Welcome to DIY Solar and Wind. I'm at the Kalamazoo Air Museum today, and all the speakers are taken, so I'm going to do it. <laughs> so if you want to make your own electricity, you want to make a solar pool heater, and such, all the links are down below. And you can learn how to make your own electricity, just one solar panel at a time. So this is going to be a little jiggly till I get over to the board. Are you ready? North American T28 Trojan. The North American T28 Trojan was the last of a line of trainers produced by North American Aviation. It was also the last radial engine trainer to be used by the U.S. Air Force and the U.S. Navy. The Trojan was produced in 1948 to replace the aging T6 Texan as a primary and basic trainer, but was converted into ground attack and anti-guerrilla aircraft. The French acquired T. Uh, the French acquired 245 Trojans in 1960 and put them into service in Algeria under the name of Fennec. A later version, T-28D, was used in Vietnam War by the U.S. forces and South Vietnam Air Forces. The U.S. Air Force and the U.S. Navy models differed considerably. The Air Force's model used had a Wright R-1300 seven-cylinder engine producing 800 horsepower. The Navy model T-28B had slight structural modifications and a Wright R-1820 engine driving a three-bladed propeller. The increase in performance was considerable. The later Navy model T-28C was strengthened and made longer to accommodate landing hooks. Awesome. I didn't know. Welcome to the Blue Angels. Awesome history. And have a nice sunny day.